Hello, Steel Town Railroader here, and today I'd like to discuss my top picks for the Lionel 2020 Volume 2 catalog. My first top pick is none other than the Pensy S1. Um, personally, I probably will never get one of these because of how big they are, but never say never. I really like the Tuscan one and I really like the calendar version. Those are the two bottom ones. Um, I wish I could, I really wish I could get that, this, that steam engine because I love Pensy Power. And I think it'd be really cool to have at least one of those two engines. The next item I really like is the shark nose diesels. Um, mo most specifically the US Army and Pennsylvania ones. I really like those US Army ones. I think they're based on the Flying Tigers. Personally, I probably won't get this one either, but never say never. The next item is the uh, GP7s and cab forwards. Personally, I highly think that I would probably get a GP7 if anything. Um, the road names that inter interest me in that batch are the B&O and the Rock Island. I would probably end up getting the Rock Island over the B&O. But anyway, I like them, both the Rock Island and the B&O. Then there's the Cab Fords. I really like the Cab Fords because it's a steam engine. And the, there's one that I would get. Believe it or not, it is not the daylight version. But actually, the gray boiler version. Yeah. I really like the gray boiler version. Um, I think that's a really cool engine. And I would put like a small Christmas wreath around the headlight. And then there is the Chesapeake and Ohio Steam Freight Set. This one is really neat. I wish it was 2.0, but I'm not going to complain because it's only $400. And a set like that, with a steam engine like that, that's a pretty good deal. Um, I highly probably get this one because I'm a CNO fan. Um, I really like the CNO walking brakeman car as well. I'd add it to it. And then maybe every once in a while, if I was to get the B&O Jeep, I would switch out the B&O engine, the, B the CNO steam engine with the B&O Jeep to kind of show, I guess, CSX, I don't know. Anyway, I really like the Chesapeake and Ohio set. Then the last thing I would like in this catalog is this 
Sergeant Stumpy's fireworks shop. That thing looks freaking hilarious. It's like, oh my god, that thing is so cool. Um, I don't remember how much it costs though. It's probably over a hundred dollars, safe to say. But that thing is hilarious, and I really like that accessory. <laughs>